And now, your local weather authority forecast. Clear skies and pretty chilly air to start off on this Valentine's Day, but it's going to be a lovely day later today. Very sunny and warming up in a big way. This is a live look at Midland early on your also hump day, your Wednesday morning. We have a good look at the Wilco building, where before sunrise, we're under night vision. We're seeing those black and white colors, dark skies, and again, once again, Cloud-free skies, satellite and radar showing most areas starting off cloud-free, but we do notice off to our south, wispy clouds moving from the southwest to the northeast, closer to the Rio Grande, and not only are we dealing with pretty clear skies, but slightly warmer air compared to yesterday morning at this time, courtesy of those wind particles moving from south to north, indicating the subtly flow of winds that will eventually warm things up in a big way later today. Clear skies officially sitting at right around the 42 degree mark in Midland and dropping, I think we'll be in the upper 30s before your morning commute, before we start warming up after sunrise, which is 732 this morning. A little bit humid, but not quite as humid as yesterday morning, 65% relative humidity, good visibility, and a southerly breeze right around 8 miles per hour. Most areas experiencing pretty calm winds, but once again, a little bit more breezy there in Fork Stockton. The subtly flown winds around 12 miles per hour there and throughout the rest of the basin. That will eventually warm things up as those temperatures rise. So those winds and a little bit more of a westerly component in those winds from the Van Horn region to the Guadalupe Pass all the way to southeast of Mexico. These blue and yellow colored areas indicate winds gusting again in the mountains of the Trans Pecos close to 30, close to 40 miles per hour. A bit of a breezy day, but less breezy in northern and eastern areas of the basin. So it will be a nice day to enjoy the outdoors either way. Very sunny, high temperature 71, warmer than yesterday with above normal temperatures ensuing basin wide. Again, 71, not too bad. Lovely weather, milder and dry. Winds generally from the south southwest right around 5 to 15 miles per hour. We got ways to go. We're sitting at the freezer mark in Pecos, 28 in Marfa. Not too bad there in Midland and Big Spring, sitting at 42 degrees respectively. Eventually warming up from the upper 20s, 30s and low 40s into, for most areas, the 60s and 70s, lower 70s along I-20 and a little bit warmer in Fork Stockton down closer to the Rio Grande. Clear skies overnight in the first half of the overnight, but then more clouds later in the overnight. Temperatures in the 40s, not as chilly, but dry. Winds from the west from 5 to 15 miles per hour. A drier overnight and early morning kind of uh, type of weather tomorrow morning compared to what we are seeing this morning. Again, ample sunshine today, just some wispy clouds off to our south. We'll see that cloud field begin to move northward overnight to tomorrow morning, but these clouds very high up in the atmosphere and very thin. And that will still allow for higher temperatures tomorrow for some, but maybe a little bit cooler in Midland 70 with a low temperature of 42 degrees. Still dry, but slightly more humid winds a little bit more from the south as compared to the west. Again, lovely weather on this Valentine's Day. Today, 71, 70 tomorrow, upper 60s on Friday. Cold front comes through late Friday, cooling things off on Saturday.